Hey, thanks for stopping by Closing the Distance today in the Moment of Truth segment. If you're here, it means that you came here because you're interested in a personal relationship with God through His Son, Jesus Christ. The first thing that I want to say to you is um, there's nothing you can do to make God love you anymore, and there's nothing that you can do to make God love you any less. You don't have to earn His love. He loves you just like you are. One of the most famous verses in all of God's Word, maybe you know it even if you don't attend church, is John 3:16. For God so loved the world that He gave His only begotten Son, that whosoever believeth in Him should not perish, but have everlasting life. That's all of us. Now, I know what you're saying. You might say that it doesn't make logical sense. I mean, why would God send His Son for people that don't love Him or don't even know Him or really wanted anything to do with Him? Well, that's the amazing part of grace. There's no explanation for it. It's just that God's love was so great that He loves us like we are but He loves us too much to allow us to stay that way. So if you're here, here's how you come to Christ. The Bible says in Romans chapter 10 that if we believe in our heart and we confess with our mouth the Lord Jesus, that uh, God raised Him from the dead, that He lives for us today, that we're saved. And so it's a very simple prayer. No big religious you know, prayers or anything like that. You just simply say, Lord, I'm coming to You and I need You in my life and I ask You to forgive me of all of my sins. I accept what Jesus Christ did on the cross. I accept that you sent him for me. And if you'll help me, Lord, I want to live the rest of my life to please you. It really is that simple. And if you prayed that prayer and meant it from your heart, God's going to do a great work in your life. And there's a couple of things that I would love to, to say to you about jump-starting your journey with Jesus, okay? The first thing I want to say to you is you really need to find a great local church in your area. Wherever you live, around the country, wherever you're viewing Closing the Distance from uh, and getting it uh, on your television set, find a great local church in your area. Find a pastor who loves you and the people who can love you and, and preach God's word to you. That connection is going to help you grow in your relationship with God. Um, being isolated isn't going to work. You really need to connect with some people that can help you in your walk and your journey with God. Let me say number two to you that um, just because you give your life to Christ does not exempt us from the problems of life. I've been walking with God for 22 years, been a pastor for 20, and I still got problems like everybody else. I got financial issues from time to time, right? I have uh, you know, issues in my life. Things don't always go the way that I want it. Here's the way I like to tell people. When you come to Jesus, it doesn't mean the subtraction of problems from life. Coming to Christ is simply the addition of power to meet your problems head on in a brand new way. So God's going to give you power to deal with those problems of life. But it doesn't mean that all of a sudden everything's just going to be hunky-dory and everything's going to be fantastic. There's still going to be some problems. Don't let that alarm you. And number three, get up every day and just surrender it to God. Don't worry about if you mess up or you make a mistake or you, you, know, you, you, you say something or you do something that you shouldn't and you go, man, it must not be real. I must not have you know, really accepted Christ. That's, that nothing could be further from the truth. We all make mistakes. We all fail from time to time. Just get up and keep going every single day. Don't let it discourage you. You'll eventually get where you want to be and where God wants you to be. It's a daily journey. It's not a destination. It's a journey that happens every day. We're praying for you right here, all the guys at Closing the Distance. We hope that Christ becomes very real in your life, and we pray that God would lead you and guide you um, all the days of your life. God bless you. And if you'd like to know more information even beyond this, then you can just email us at info at ccalachua.com. And our church here in Florida would love to send you some information to help you in your walk with God and to help get you where you need to be. God bless you. Love you guys. Hope you have a great day.